Hey everyone, Techman here with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the new Proofread AI writing tool on your iPhone. So let's get started. Now, this feature is powered by AI on the newer iPhones. You have to update first your software on your iPhone by going to your settings, general software update, and you have to update to 18.1, which is the latest version. Once you have updated, you see the new feature of Apple Intelligent that's going to be available for you to join and then set up and once you have set that up now your phone can use this writing tool as an example now i'm going to show you on a note but this can also work on emails and other apps as well that has writing possibility so i'll click on notes here and i have notes here for one that i wrote here and i want to do some pre proofreading so in order to do that right here you'll see a tool that looks like uh basically the ai version of the pencil if i tap on that it will bring up the writing tools. So these are the available writing tools available on iOS 18.1. And the one that we're gonna see is the proofread one. So if I want AI to proofread my uh, text here, I simply tap on that and it will begin and correct the proofread of it. And you can see it made six changes and we can see those. We can go ahead and see where they are and what they did with it. So reading here, some proofreading here, here and there as well. So six of them, I can hit done here if I'm satisfied with it and click on done. And now I have a note that has been pre-read with the AI tool on my iPhone. Again, pretty cool and easy to use. Again, just tap on that. Whenever you're in a writing icon, we'll bring up the writing tool and then you can go ahead and proofread and you can accept the changes or you can edit them as well. As you saw when I click on proofread here now, I don't have any more, but you get the idea here. So that's how you proofread on your iPhone. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider hitting a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. We'll see you guys next time.